One hundred years ago, monsters raged across Victuja. They destroyed farms, decimated the dwindling animal population, and attacked our people on sight. Famine and death swept the land. No one had dared to hunt and cook monsters for centuries, fearing their cursed flesh. It was then that King Heinrich and Chef Robichon delivered Victuja from the brink of... King extinction. Heinrich? That's Together, my name, they but like the finest it's German. culinary institution this world Lit, has ever seen. It, boys. The Battle Chef I'm Brigade, in this game. A legion of elite as a legendary king on the frontier of the culinary world. Amazing. Now battle chefs across the land stand as our protectors and providers, bringing monster cuisine from hunt to table. As summer begins, so does our tournament. Drawing forth the next generation of culinary warriors. What new styles of cooking will we witness this year? What tantalizing dishes will be revealed? This year's tournament is sure to be our fiercest yet. I actually do like the voice acting in this so far. Well, I mean, I only heard one voice, but it sounds pretty good. Windy Village. I'm off to the market. Don't buy the blue squiggle again. It tasted spoiled last time. I'll ask the brigadiers about it. Where's Saskia? <gasps> MTG Saskia? Oh boy. Trying to wake Mina up. She just keeps saying ten more minutes. Mina, get down here now. Saskia, let's go. We're already late. Mina, if you don't come down this instant. I'm up. Stop yelling. Literally me. It's like, I don't want to get up, please. Is the restaurant on fire or something? You know it's busiest on Fridays. Finish that Karano Mabo Tofu order for table two. <sighs> All right. All right, so let's see how this game plays. Okay, so... Oh, that's why? Okay. Okay. Add the ingredient. There you go. Ma, these ingredients taste a bit off to me. A couple of things we got from the market were strange. Not sure what's going on. Spoiled. Run, run noodle soup. Spoiled it. On it. Spoiled it. <laughs> yes. Yeah, spoil. Oh, it's, oh, okay. More stuff, I guess. Go. Just drop it, I guess. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Stir. Neat. What? Okay. You stayed up training for the brigade again, didn't you? Uh, uh it was Saskia's idea. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Why not? I suppose it was Saskia's idea the last ten times, too. Yeah, Saskia's a bad influence. You know, your father and I would love you to apply, but we need you here. We're not going to be around forever, and your sister isn't even married. Sounds like a personal problem. <sighs> Oh, please. Ah, I just saw Simon outside. Go gather some fresh ingredients. He looks like he's in the mood for something off menu. I can always tell by how much he's slouching. His standards aren't that high. A 50 point dish should do. Run! Okay, so attack is back. Oh, that's jump. Ah, wait! Okay. Neat. Uh, pick up. Oh. Okay. Probably gonna have to change these controls to fit my needs. You leave me alone.
Alright, eat it so you can... There you go. Thank you. Thank you. I'll slay you too. I want you. Eh! You... Second combo in this game. Oh, give me that. I want that. Why not? Sure. Make you something simple, boy. Actually. Drop. Drop. Ooh. Oh, I guess not. There you go. Get some more eggs, because you can't have enough eggs. Alright. Ah, wait. Put it down. Start cooking it. <laughs> Neat. So flipping close. What the hell? No. Oh wait. Oh, le le at least fifty. Okay, cool. Hey, Mina. Got a new experiment for me to try? You bet. Only the finest from our backyard. Dig in. It's horrible. What? <laughs> nah, it's actually good. But I have to keep your ego in check. <laughs> Rude. Don't scare me like that. Oh, Simon, it looks like we'll need some extra satchels of grain and flour. We're running through it a lot faster than expected. Mina, go over to Simon so he doesn't have to make a double trip. I really don't mind. You live so close by. Hush, I'll go. Give this money to his father when you get there. Thank you, Mrs. Han. Be back in a flash. Simon, wait. Before we get there, I need to tell you something. I... I... I've always liked you! What's up? I'm... not going to be around for a while. Damn. <laughs> Evaded my expectations. Ah, did you get grounded for brigade training again? This isn't a joke! I'm finally going to do it. <laughs> Mina, I think you're way too old for that now. Run away, running away from home. a tantrum. Mom and Dad will never let me leave for the brigade. If I wait for their permission, I'll be stuck cooking the same recipes for the same people forever. That's not necessarily true. You could change up the menu. When I make it in, I'll get to travel the land and learn about everything in the world of food. Hey, look at the sparkle That's sparkle. more than I could ever do here. You're serious then? Dead serious. I've got what it takes and I'm not growing enough. It's as serious as the heart attacks that I'm going to be cooking up for people. Stuff. Mom is gonna flip like that. The only person who scares me more than my dad is your mom. Couldn't you wait till the restaurant picks back up a bit? It hasn't been doing so great lately. Plenty of new travelers will be passing through on their way to the proving tournament. They'll be fine. You don't own a coin your parents haven't given you first. How are you gonna? Nina Han, you rogue. Now I'm gonna be an accomplice. I knew I could count on you. This money is just enough to apply, and a bit extra. Think you could help a neighbor out and spot me some flour? I don't like this. But, how can I refuse my favorite neighbor? <laughs> I don't know, I, I just find this whole situation really funny. It's just like, oh, hey, yo. Hold up. Be a bro. Get, let me cop this money. <laughs> oh, lord. Thank you, Simon. We should get going. Our parents are gonna be annoyed that we're taking so long. God of Barley, give me strength. Your mom is gonna kill me. I'll name a dish after you in the tournament. Before 
I go. How about one more practice, hey Kiki? Sure. Why don't we practice with wind magic one last time? All right. We should have some time before Ma gets back from Auntie's house. I can't believe our little Mimi is all grown up. <sighs> it's really happening. Go to the backyard. All right. This is okay. Just... Ah! Come on, go, go eat that. All right, whatever. Uh, sure. Let's... Screw it. Oh, before I forget, did you pack enough underwear? What? I think so. Remember, I gave you some of Dad's stationery. I want you to write every week. Every week! Kiki, stop acting like Mom. Hey, I have to make sure I'm not allowing you out to die in a ditch somewhere. Well, I'll have plenty of underwear and stationery with me in that ditch. <sighs> Alright, you better get going. Thanks, Kiki. <clears throat> you have no idea what this opportunity means to me. Oh, I know. Don't screw up. And here, take this cookie jar with you. A little reminder of home. Hey! You know. <laughs> they say it's good luck for that to happen when you first come into town. Huh? <clears throat> Is that Patrick Sates? What the hell? It's a capital thing. I'm Thrash, by the way. You're looking to register for the tournament, aren't you? It, it, it sounds like Patrick Sates. That's oh, weird. Yes. I mean, a if y'all don't know who Patrick Sates is, is a Gamagori from like Kill a Kill and stuff like that. And he did, he did like. A little bit more. I just can't time. remember off the top of my head. That's a knife bag at your side, and you've got a pan handle sticking out of the back of your satchel. Right. <laughs> Marking the other contestants is easy. You can sense a special aura about them, burning with excitement. <laughs> Look at me getting all worked up. Anyway, this is the back of the line. Up there with the pink-haired woman is where we register. Man, this guy right here. Just is like so freaking done with everything. Oh lord, that's funny. Wow, that's a lot of contestants. This isn't even a half of it. I hear there's somewhere around 50 hopefuls. That's so awesome. But this line, yeesh. I just walked 30 miles and I don't have the energy for this. Well, you can cut in front of me if you like. Really? You're so kind, thanks! Okay, this isn't gonna do. Time for some Mina magic! Huh? I'll see you around. Gotta go! <laughs> Excuse me! Pardon me! Just trying to get through! There we go. Next! Hey, she cut! 
Hi, I'm here for the... It'll be 10 gold to register. Yes, I have that. Here you go. <laughs> she, she turned into a little Oba, uh, like, oh, Baba-sama. Just like, yo, let me cut through. Oh, no. That's funny. Take this form and fill it out. Hand it to the gentleman to my right. Next! Mina Han, age 21, from the Windy Village. Title? Let's see. Well, Simon always calls me the Iron Stomach since I can eat anything. Done! Here is your registration number. Don't lose it. If you do, tough bricks. <laughs> You know, for a second there, I thought it was going to here is your registration number. Don't lose it if you do tough breaks for you, yeah? Uh, I thought he was going to do it like that, but I guess not. Damn, Krauss. Tomorrow, your orientation is at 6 a.m. And the opening ceremony is at 4 p.m. 6 a.m.? I better go find a place to stay and rest up. Ba -ba, ba -ba. Wanna pet the cat? Good afternoon. Room for one. How much per night? Two gold a night, and we have complimentary breakfast here. My wife cooks up a storm. If you're here for the tournament, you can stay for the entirety of the competition for 20. It's a steal. Perfect. Although, that leaves me with nothing left. And what if I get eliminated early? Man, you asked out. That's what, that's what it means. <laughs> you're done. No, I'm not going to get kicked <clears throat> out. I can do this. If you need to scrounge up some change, you could always do one of the jobs available in town. Wonderful. Thank you, sir. That'll do. Enjoy your stay and break the dish. What? Oh, it's probably another saying. Let me show you to your room. It's like break a leg, but I guess... Eh. Wow, this is really nice. We do our best. I'll let you get settled in. If you need anything, you know where to find me. Thank you, sir. Maybe I'll just take a small nap. A small nap. Sounds good. That's not a small nap. You nap through the next day. <laughs> what time is it? Oh, I need boy. to get downstairs. All right, let's go. What? Mm. Curious. Oh, excuse me. Oops, sorry about that. No, I wasn't looking where I was going. Kieran? Like the beer? No, I'm just playing. More, more like Kieran the like the lightning horse from Monster Hunter. There's quite a few smells wafting around here. Of the unbathed nature. I just got in yesterday myself. I'm registered for the tournament and everything. I'm me. Wait a second. Oh no. Oh no! I slept through orientation! Oh my. Well, if you need someone to get you up to speed, I'd be happy to help. I'm Kieran. And you are? Mina! That would be so great! We can use the practice kitchen so you're not going into things cold tomorrow. I'll act as your referee. But first, let's find you an opponent. I challenge you! I challenge you, hey. sir! You seem busy. Hey, it's Thrash! Oh. Hey. I was so close. Thrash, I was wondering if you'd like to get a little practice in. How about it? Sure! I live for cooking battles. We should have just enough time before the opening ceremony. And you won't want to miss that. Good. I see you found a partner. Let's head to the practice kitchen and get started. Let's do this. <laughs> Alrighty. So, 
What exactly do I need to do to make it into the brigade? You must challenge other chefs in town to matches similar to this. Official matches are carried out in the Kitchen Coliseum, overseen by Chairman Common and the judges. Contestants must earn seven wins to enter the final round. Chefs with three losses are eliminated. Well, that won't happen to us, right, Mina? No way! We're going to make it to the final round! <clears throat> yes. As for the cooking itself, there are three things to avoid if you don't want to lose points during judging. First, always incorporate the match's theme ingredient in your dishes. Second, make sure to place your dishes in front of the judges within the time limit. Third, don't leave anything harmful to the judges in your ingredients, like poison. <laughs> I think that goes without saying, but okay. I, I guess, because apparently poison doesn't exist in this world. There's also a way to gain <clears throat> points, and that's by using ingredients that match the judges' taste preferences. All right, I think I got it. Let's do this. Very well. Provide me with a dish predominantly flavored with earth. Ah, yes, dirt. And your theme ingredient for this round is... Karana. Let's go. Oh, I never thought I'd get to say this, but in the words of Chairman Common, Vive la Brigade! Freaking go! Alright. Get in the Oh! No! No, you don't! <clears throat> I need that gel! That uh, king bee. What the hell? I wanted that tomato. Okay. No, I want this. Give me this. The ultimate bean. The king bean. Dun 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 dun. All right. Man, you're gonna have some tomato soup. Eh. I only have three minutes to cook this guy for saving thing. Alrighty. Let's cook. King Beans! Where is it? Oh, okay. It's right there. King Green! Alright.
more King B. Done, you two. Let's see what we have here. Perfect. Divine. Aha. Best. Lit. It is with pride I announce our winner is Mina. Congratulations. Beep, beep, beep. I did it. Beep, 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 beep. We in it, boys. We the best. I was hoping this would calm me down, but now I'm more excited for the tournament to start than before. That was a great warm-up. Mina, you're a strong competitor. Really? Mm-hmm. You're so serious while cooking. It's admirable, but don't get too tense. I can see your mind racing in a million directions. Don't forget to breathe. It's funny how I forget to do that when I'm concentrating really hard. I've never battled against chefs from all around the country before. Just think of all the different cuisines and techniques assembled here for the tournament. It's a taste of the world. Speaking of which, I think I hear some music starting up. Let's go and enjoy the opening ceremonies. Good practice. Welcome, one and all. Victuja opens its arms to the world for the annual Battle Chef Brigade Tournament. We wait with bated breath to discover which incredible contestants will join the ranks of the brigade this year. Chefs, I implore you to search within yourselves and draw forth your deepest convictions and abilities. Tomorrow, the battles will commence. But for now, let us join together in celebrating the strength of our land and its people. Vive la Brigade! Hooray! Alright, chapter one is complete. August. Augusto. <clears throat> Attention! Rise and shine, soldier! <laughs> Instructor Razzle! Mina Han, are you not feeling well? No, ma'am. I'm feeling great. Your fellow contestants have all gotten at least one match under their belts. Kurtz! Fallen behind already? Kurtz is foiled again. <laughs> <laughs> you need to get moving, cadet. Yes! Wait, where do I even start? My dear. If you had just woken up in time, you would have caught the briefing. I'm so sorry, Instructor. There's no more time to lose. Get dressed and go warm up with Thorn at the Hunter's Guild. Y yes ma'am! Neato. Alrighty. <clears throat> Let's see. Good afternoon. I was told to report here for warm-ups. Are you... Thorn? Maybe I was too suffocating for her. Uh, pardon? I mean, is 20 messenger doves one too many? Maybe it was the Manticore trophy I sent. 
I'm sorry, but are you the one in charge here? Oh, oh, yeah. You're another tournament baby, aren't you? Give me a second to strap up my boots and we'll head to the arena and see what you're worth. Sh sure! Actually, she casually has a snake for like a necklace or something. <clears throat> Chop, chop! Panic attack to use alcohol, but that depends on your vice. <laughs> Boy, howdy. Oh. Oh, that's how you jump down. Cool beans. Alright. Ray. Where is it? Oh. Yeah, just, I just found a gold coin. Sounds good, fam. Okay, you have your gold. I always have more challenges on the bounty board, so come back later. Or don't. Not many do. Most people are all about the coin, not about the hunt. Um, well, thank you for the instruction today. I'll put it to good use. I see a dragon that's slain. Stuff like that. Oh. Was this? Pecorino, shoo, shoo! Stop eating my experiment. Is this a pet store? Settle down, miss, and have some tea. Bree, Fontina, get out of there. I'm Mina, by the way. Charm, Belchior, gastronomy wizard extraordinaire at your service. Wow, that's some title. What do you do here exactly? Well, my lady, I'm in the process of creating a super flavor enhancer. A flavor enhancer. It'll accept Boy. the consumer's favorite flavors, so it'll be universally delicious. Ambrosia! How are you going to make this like happen? Like ambrosia salad? My experiment requires me to extract the essence of a hundred different dishes, but the progress is slow. I'm looking for assistance, but you'd be surprised how many people in town are allergic to cats. Well, it sounds interesting to me. Is it a paid job? Of course! I'm a professional! The brigade funds all my research. So, how can I help? Most of my recipes are almost complete. I just need a hand finishing them up. Would you be so kind? Okay. Do you want me to complete them or I guess he wants me to complete them? Still cooking with gas, boys. Ah. Um. Neat. What's here?
I get money. Well done. You're right. It looks like Pecorino has taken a liking to you. And I'm sure he'd appreciate you visiting. Thanks, Pecorino. You you a nice little cat. I like cats. Anyway. Uh... Oh. <laughs> okay. Where's the restaurant? Ah, there it is. So you're here to apply for the line order cook possession? Can you handle all the orders? My family owns a restaurant back home, so I've got some experience. I've never worked anywhere else, though. We'll get you into the swing of things here. Beat the tournament happening. I'm swamped for the customers from out of town. I'm also a bit short-stiffed, since two of my sous chefs are off trying to earn their wings for the brigade. I'll do my best. Here at the Crescent, we prioritize the customer's time and hunger. Not everyone has the time or coin for an exquisite meal cooked by a real better chef. That's where you come in, recruit. Your goal as a line order cook is to fill customers' orders as quickly as possible. For each order, all that matters is that the requested taste gem pattern is somewhere in the dish. Our pans here don't even get hot enough to upgrade taste gems. So don't make any big plans for grandiose dishes. Here, try this on for size. Okay. Uh. Uh. Wait. Okay. What? Alright. Oh boy. This is actually gonna be legitimately hard. Oh, thank you so much. That is actually true. <laughs> I'm not actually tired, but when I'm doing this, it's gonna be rough. Uh, let's see here. All right, how do I do this? Hey, right. I did it! All right, he, he can be taught. All right. Recruit. 
You've managed to exceed my expectations. <laughs> I do my best. Well, I hope you'll return. The Crescent could use a shave like you. Welcome, citizens and esteemed guests, to the inaugural day of this year's Proving Tournament. It is my great honor to preside over what will assuredly be a pulse-pounding centennial. The contestants before you have traveled from across Victusia to showcase their skills in the illustrious Kitchen Coliseum. Only an elite few will rise from the ranks and emerge as brigadiers. Let's hear it for their bravery! Mina Han loves dreaming up adventurous new dishes at her family restaurant. Hailed in her town as the Iron Stomach, she's sure to serve up intriguing creations. <sighs> My stomach's definitely not made of iron right now. Mina! Father of two and champion of orc fusion cuisine, Thrash's priorities are family, community, and good food. Few can stand before his might as the Benevolent Berserker! Yeah, show me what you got! Thrash! Man, this guy can hype up anybody. <laughs> it's my pleasure to present our longest running judge, Ambassador Akebo! You're too kind, Chairman. It's an honor and a privilege to sit at the judge's platform for the centennial. Ah, there's nothing like a dish with plenty of fire to invigorate the senses. People of Victusia, I struggled with the choice for today's theme ingredient for weeks before it came to me during meditation. Simplicity. One of King Heinrich's favorite monsters to hunt and eat charging across the plains and forests in dangerous herds. Bow run! <laughs> Chefs, please place your dishes on the judge's platform within the time limit. Grace this kitchen with the best cooking you have to offer. Vive la Brigade! Da -da -dun. Off I go.
to the boys. That should be good. Thank you for your hard work, chefs. Let's see what our judge has to say about your efforts. Wow! Delicious! Stomach's done it. Mina Han wins. Yeah. Um. Burrito. Hey, you're really amazing. Oh, that's that was a fun match. I hope we get to battle alongside one another someday. Wow, thanks, Thrash. Jeez, my face is getting all red, isn't it? I want you to have this. It's from my home tribe. If you make it into the brigade and become famous, I don't want you to forget about old Thrash. Dagger set enemies on fire. Got it. That's pretty funny. All right. Time to go sleep. Night, night. <laughs> I am exhausted. This was only my first match. I'm gonna have to pace myself here. I haven't even realized till now that I'm hungry. I 
cooked all day and didn't eat anything for myself. <sighs> I'll eat a big breakfast tomorrow to make up for it. Look at her go. It's like a trash compactor. Huh? We're just admiring your appetite. You're like me. I could eat a whole food truck and still be a stick. What's a food truck? You're Mina Han, aren't you? I heard about the iron stomach at the opening ceremony. Oh, wow. No one in my village actually calls me that. Just my friend. I think the tournament committee tries to play everyone up. I'm nothing special. <laughs> hey, now, don't say that. Having a stomach made of iron is pretty incredible. Mine's made of paper. Plus, you're here. And only the best of the best are in Capital City. We'll see. Either way, I'm really excited for the opportunity. Had a go? Well, if you'll excuse me, I've got places to be. Graves to dig up. See ya! Oh, here. Catch. Huh. Metal trinket of some sort. What a strange guy. Did he say he was going to dig up graves? I'm surprised you didn't get it the first time around, but okay. Uh, let's see. There you go. Neat. Is it the practice kitchen? Welcome to the practice kitchen, cadet. Have you been here before? Yes. I fit in a quick practice match with Kieran and Thrash before the opening ceremony. A wise decision. Well then, you know that you're free to use this kitchen as long as you like. Practicing isn't a requirement, but if you're ever unsure of a new tool you've acquired or new tastes you've discovered, consider coming here before challenging someone. Makes sense to me. Good. I'm off to check in on the others. Best of luck, cadet. Thank you kindly. Hurry. Let's go. And we're going to leave because I don't think we need anything right now. I don't need to practice. I'm the best. I am the master. All right. <clears throat> so they want me to. Ooh, not you. I'm going to fight you. All right, cool. Let's fight Kieran then. Let us begin. Let us indeed begin. Alrighty. I woke this morning reminded of a quote from the legendary chef Robichon. An ingredient is only as extraordinary as the chef who wields it. This man has consistently changes his outfit. I like that. Like he looking dapper as hell. When I look at our contestants, I see the precision of their blades and the richness of 10,000 flavors boiling in their hearts. Extraordinary he doesn't even begin to cut it. I cannot wait to see the wonders they have in store for our judge today. Riding on the winds of her first victory, the Iron Stomach is ready to claim another win. Mina! Kieran has studied medicinal gastronomy since childhood. Her unwavering attention to detail earned her the title, The Decisive Blade, from her instructors. An interesting matchup indeed. Kieran! That judge is headmistress of the prestigious Aurus Academia. Please welcome Instructor Meridane! You've no need to flatter me so. We'll soon discover just how competent these chefs truly are. Water is mercurial by nature. A chef that truly masters its flavor becomes as adaptive as the energy itself. It is in your best interest to impress me with it. Oh boy. For today's theme ingredient, we look to a beast that has a heart of fire. Every hunter knows the fearsome dragon! <sighs> I 
See, I've I've watched like speedruns and regular playthroughs of this, and I dreaded fighting. I, I I dreaded. I was just like, man, I'm gonna get this game, but I'm gonna hate fighting this creature. Now I have to fight it. Vive la brigade. Uh, okay. Gotta crickety crack the neck, and then we get started. Uh, water, right? So, the pantry. Sapphire to you. Alrighty. Yo, you want some, like, hot water? No. That was more annoying than it had to be. Alright. Oh wait, no, I need that. Alright. Should work. Ah. And then I have to cook this guy for second thing? Alright, I guess. Thank you for 
Jesus Christ. Scrumptious. Wrecked. All right. Try Our again. winner possess Chiri. Try it again. It's because that dragon killed me. I was like, ah, alright. Then I have to learn how to deal with that. Forget I could dodge. boys alrighty ah what the fuck uh, that was actually really funny Oh, 
this. Alright, cool. Take it. There it is. Alright. Thank you for your hard work, chefs. Let's see what our judge has to say about your efforts. Disgraceful. Exceptional. The Iron Stomach Clench is another hard-fought victory. Mina Ha wins! All right! You certainly are more resourceful than you appear. I underestimated you. Gee, thanks. I meant only to say that you show a lot of promise for your age. Here, take this. May it aid you in your battles ahead. Hey! Hi, Alex. How you doing? <laughs> so, I'm just, like, kind of getting used to, like, the controls for this game. So, just, like, going through the cycles and stuff like that. So, let's see. Oh, you just woke up, Lamau. That's funny. Let's uh, see here. Time to go sleep. All right. I should really study more recipes right now, but I'll just take a quick nap first. No, I agree. It's just like it's taken me a lot to like get used to, cause, especially because I'm using a PS4 controller, so the control like mapping is kind of whack. Like usually it would be geared for like an Xbox 360 controller, like you use, but um, I oh, use I'm a PS4 controller. The new expertise tome I bought from Louie and Louie. Expertise? Yes, it's the study of a particular esoteric cooking style or technique. You should really take a look into some. Judges award bonuses for demonstrating the use of expertises. Here, you can have one of mine. I've got the contents of that tome committed to memory. Boy, howdy. Expertise bonus server dish containing all ingredient types for me. Really? Okay. Oh, wow, thanks, Kieran. You're welcome. If you don't mind, though, I have to get back to studying. Oh, it's actually there. That helped out a lot. Alrighty. Let's continue. I probably need some money. So, I'll do the puzzle thing right now. I've got a. What? Oh, getting the. Watery sauce, put that there. Maybe cook the bad boy. And there you go. Uh oh yeah, no. Like the music is really nice. 
Like, it's very calming. Especially when you're, like, cooking. And, like, in, like, not the... Not in the brigade, but, like, just regular wholesome cooking. It's really nice. It doesn't, it doesn't stress you out. Let's see. Let's see like pantry. Okay. Probably did that wrong. All right, reset. I don't mind that, I guess. Uh, go back. There it is. That's one. <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. Uh, wait. Entry, earth and sauce. Uh, sure. <laughs> no! Fudged it up. Fudged it. Alright. Do. Oh, jeez. Alright. This bad boy. What do I have? So I got wood. Ah, 
jacked it up. I'm supposed to flip it and then do it. Alright, let's try that again. shall learn in due time. Did it. Keep thinking like that, and you'll be a master gastronomist in no time. Wait it, boys. I'm just like, uh, wait. We should probably, like. Mina Han, reporting for duty. Vital. I've got a new tail ready for you, won't you? Yes, Shaw. Okay. These are probably, like, the hardest ones. Ah. strange. I don't know. I don't know. Oh dear. Oh did dear. Okay, so how do I do that? <laughs> this is very interesting. Ah, yeah. I'm like trying to figure it out. And I'm like, uh... Okay. I think I almost got it. Uh, no, wait. Oh my god, I did it, barely. Thank you. Oh, 
Uh, here it is. Thank you. There it is. Thank you. Jesus. Yeah, no, that fire, that fire shape, like, really was drugged. Then what happened? He pointed to the scar on his arm and revealed that it wasn't the mark of a monster, but an enraged opponent. Whoa, just because they lost the match? Mm-hmm. There's no honor in such an act. Whoops. It's later than I realized. I've got to get going. I'll see you tomorrow, Pontita. I'm probably gonna have to grind out like those five shapes if I wanted to like learn how to speedrun this thing. Sure. Siegfried, the zombie bro. Man, I wish he was playable. I wish they like. I wish like he got far enough so he could be playable, but in like he would have been like undead or he had some like undead skills apparently, but. <laughs> Your funeral. They never got to that, and I'm like, oh, come on. I would have loved playing a Ziggy. It's another glorious day in the kitchen coliseum, and our contestants are becoming more oh, really? skillful with each huh. dish they prepare. I, I, I hope it works out, cause I'll like, I'll totally play a Ziggy. Cause I mean, playing with Thrash is pretty cool. From like what I saw on your like, on your stream, I was like, oh dude, that's so so cool. So hopefully, now hopefully like like they give us a little more like story and stuff like that, or a little more content. It'd be pretty nice. Much like the fire in our chef's hearts, the spirit of this tournament burns ever brighter. This small town chef has become something of a crowd favorite. Please welcome the Iron Stomach, Mina. This cryptic competitor employs a band of skeletal sous chefs. Boy, that alliteration. <laughs> he calls himself Ziggy. The fast food fiend! Who's ready to clog their arteries? Ziggy! I, I, I know why you're the next judge fast food in. I want them dead so they can dig up their corpses. With each challenge that passes, these chefs reveal more of themselves through their creations. I look forward to learning more today. Some chefs mistake Earth for the most simplistic energy. But its purity belies subtle complexities. Bring me a dish that harnesses its potential. Today we welcome back Ambassador Akebo to the judges' platform. Ah, what a fine day for a match. I'm anxious to taste today's dishes. I actually really don't like Akebo's voice. It sounds so... Um... Uh, inter intermittent. It's like... Uh, what a fine day for a match. And I'm like, oh... Sounds like <laughs> he sounds like William Shatner, in a way. At the annual fire festival, local food stands make spicy kebabs that are out of this world. I'd like to see the contestants bring that kind of fiery flavor to today's challenge. Okay. In my youth, I refused to eat this beast's meat out of fear its curse would pass to me. Like our ancestors, I fear what I didn't understand. Luckily, our chefs today are fearless in the face of the unknown. Let's see what they can do with... Burskit! Oh, I'm in the air place now? Sick. Alright. Vive la Brigade! I mean, I agree. Like, he is actually very well-spoken from, like, the two times that I've seen him. 
Yeah. But I mean, I, I don't think the actor, like the tone, I don't think the tone is right. Yo, let's do the se super secret tech. <laughs> oh, it's funny. Boy, howdy. Speedrun tech. cooking real quick. All right. Brisky tooth. Six minutes, right? Uh, pantry. I only need you because Wait. There it is. All right. Ooh yeah. All right. Cool. So I feel like this is gonna be okay. No. Well, you know what? Set it down here. For now, at least. And then... Stop, leave me alone. Okay. So, Tails. What the... Okay. Oh, I forget! I guess I'll just do it like that. Put it down. Hey Mina, you seem great. No, wrong. Sometimes he likes to wander into other people's cookware and explode their creations. I'm sure it won't happen this time. Iceberg turnips. Two minutes. Pinky. Got one more of these. Yes. Sick nasty. All right. Down, cook it. 
Mito Burrito. Alright. Give me that. <laughs> Just swipe it real quick. Alright. Wait. Pantry. I feel like I can win that way. This guy. Sure. Leave luck to heaven. Thank Let's see how this goes. Let's. Probably not. I probably Your won't win. Inspiration. I guess shrug shruggo. Oh dear. One twenty two. Outstanding. Dang it. Did I get it? I don't know. Another stunning game <laughs> the stomach. Mina wins. <laughs> oh wow, my seven points? Jesus. Sure, we take those. You're a necromancer? Isn't that unsanitary for our line of work? Just because I get assistance from the undead doesn't mean I don't have standards. I wear gloves. I've heard stories about this kind of magic, but I thought it was evil. No offense. Huh. You and the committee. Apparently, I've got them all wild up. They want to add a new rule just to kick me out. Pretty boring culinary experts, if you ask me. They don't even want to put haunt cuisine in their mouths. Hmm. I understand their concerns. I got a jet, but look for me if you ever want to try haunt cuisine. I hear you're a brave soul. Um, sure. Thanks for the match. Sayonara. I'm scared to know what his food's made of. A spicy sauce. Watch yourself, girl. Otsu is missing and he's very crafty. Not to mention deadly. Who's Otsu? Well, now we may begin. Nice. Uh, we need that. 
You gonna eat that? <laughs> I'll eat it. So that I can, like, get eggs. Thanks, fam. Thanks, fam. How was that, instructor? <sighs> Your form needs work. Alrighty. Time to sleep. Everyone's cuisines are so different here. I'm going to have to give it everything I've got to make mine stand out. I bet Kiki and Simon would know what to do. They'd have a joke ready and everything. Instructor, good morning. Uh, am I in trouble? Is that what you think just from me showing up? I'm checking in with all the contestants. I'm sorry. Well, I have three wins on my belt now. Just four more to go. I've heard. Once you've completed that, you're cleared for the Proving Tournament's ultimate feat, Robichon's Trial. The three-round gauntlet against the Brigade's most talented chefs? I've been dreaming of it all my life! Are you prepared to face the final three? Thinking about it just gives me chills. I believe in you. Just keep working hard, Pumpkin. I've got others to see, but good luck today. Thank you, ma'am. Eventually figure out the routing for the game. I don't think I need anything right now, but where the hell is Caesar? So I can fight him. I can't. there's like a two-headed dude just casually here interesting I don't think I need any of these I would like the ruby jerky though because that's actually pretty cool
Welcome once again to the most invigorating exhibition of culinary excellence in all of Victusia. Yesterday we mourned with contestants who suffered their second loss and cheered those who dazzled our judges' persnickety palates. Like the pounding tides of the Silian Sea, the iron stomach seems unstoppable. Mina! Our next contestant declined to provide a title, saying, I don't need a fancy title to make great food. I present Caesar! <clears throat> Caesar! Said it twice. Today, these <laughs> chefs seek to please two of the sharpest minds of our age. The first I'm proud to present is Instructor Meridane. At ease, Chairman. You are no longer a student of mine, after all. My attention is focused solely on the techniques of these chefs. Be careful not to oversaturate today's dish with bold flavors. Doing so will bury the intoxicating crispness of water. The next judge is the famed Grand Matriarch, Asjil. With each challenge that passes, these chefs reveal more of themselves through their creations. I look forward to learning more today. Foraging for ingredients is a vital skill. So today, I ask you to scour the Skylands for a bit of earth to ground your dish. Boy, howdy. This Skylands delicacy used to be so rare that it was exclusively eaten by royalty. Even now, collection requires a chef with sharp eyes and the speed of a tempest. Wind fruit! Oh boy, wind fruit. Vive la brigade! All right, let's go, buddy. I guess it's not there.
Thank you for your hard work, chefs. We'll find out. Let's see what the judges have to say about your efforts. Unpalatable. Die. <laughs> totally imbalanced. Oh no, 173. Positively superb. No. Oh well. Oh well. I whip. Okay. The winner is infamous, you say? Huh. By 20, right? Pretty much. Okay. This is fine. She wants pure agua, doesn't he? Don't ya?
that will be back for you. Wind. I mean. That. Energies. Where did I put that blasted spatula? Do you need help looking for it? I'm happy to come over and... Stay where you are. Or I could just stay here. Thank you for your heart. Delightful. Scrumptious. Yeah, buddy. All right. It seems no iron skillet can stand up to the might of the iron stomach. Mina Han wins. Whoop whoop, we the best. Match 
Well thought, sir. Ah, uh, can it? Eh? Huh? We had a deal. I'm starving. Wanna go grab a bite at Crescent? This, uh, wasn't part of the deal. You're hungry, too. I heard your stomach rumbling earlier. Fine. And here. It was my daughter's from when she was little. But I have no use for it. It would suit you better. Thank you. So, you have a daughter? What's she like? Quiet. Is that a description or a command? Yes. I should probably get some dinner, but I just want to sleep. Huh? What's going on over there? Admit it. Your family donates to Judge Meridane's Academy. She gave you a free pass on that win. If you actually knew anything about me or my family, you'd know that couldn't be farther from the truth. Just how many of your royal family members are in the brigade? It's obvious nepotism. I'm surprised you know that word. If you have an issue, bring it up with the tournament committee. I'm sure they'll find your accusations to be baseless. Ha! <laughs> Run away like the cheat you are! This was your third loss. You're out of the competition. Learn to take that in stride. You can always try again another year. Why, you... <laughs> Mina! Ah! You cut my hand! Uh, I'm sorry! But you were about to hurt my friend. We need to get an officer. Can anyone help us? Oh, goodness. I told you something terrible was brewing in town. What happened here? She just threw her dagger at me! I was aiming for your skewer. It was an accident. You raised your weapon and... It looks to be only a scratch. Let's get that wrapped up. The three of you come with me. I've got a medical kit at the inn. What are you all standing around for? Move along! Now! See, Shiv, you come from an honorable lineage as well. There's no need to throw dirt on Kieran's family. Your great-grandmother is the fabled Kiln, isn't she? Uniting the Orc tribes by way of her cross-culture cuisine. She'd be ashamed of your attitudes throughout this competition. Of course, taking Kieran's side. It seems to me that the only one who expected an easy win based on their background is you. The fact remains, contestants are not allowed to draw weapons on one another in town. It's a designated safe zone. In accordance with Article 7 of the Proving Tournament Rules, you are hereby expelled from the competition for two years. What? This is bull! As for you, Mina, even though you tried to protect Kirin, you also broke the rules. You've injured Shiv's hand. And just think if your dagger had missed and hit a townsperson. I'm sorry, Instructor. You should have gotten an officer to handle the situation. You too must be expelled for endangering the people around you. Is this the only way? Although I understand the seriousness of the situation, I don't think Shiv or Mina truly meant any serious harm. Tensions were high. Threats were made. Kieran, say your farewells to them. They're expected to leave tomorrow morning. Mina, I'm so sorry. Listen, everything is going to work out. Don't give up. Mina? Get wrecked. Oh boy, now she has to go back to her fam bam and be like, hey, yo man, I just got expelled, fam. Mm, Alright, I think... I think I can, like, end it here. Can't you give her a... Uh oh. Third. Another day to take it easy? She's heartbroken. Mina needs to keep working. She has the same spirit I had at her age, including my weakness. Alright. Yeah, I'm done. Whew. Yeah, it's nice, but... Yeah, I need, I need to... Uh... Here, tch. Yeah, rest up and stuff like that. I gotta go eat anyways. So yeah, uh, yeah. Thanks 
for watching the stream. I'll probably be back. Maybe sometime in like the next couple days. Uh, maybe like on Monday of next week. So if yeah, I'll I'll be back soon. All right, peace out, y'all.